Let's learn about Antarctica. Antarctica is Earth's southernmost continent. The furthest south place on the Earth, the South Pole, is just about in the middle of Antarctica. At the South Pole, the sun rises once a year and sets once a year. So night lasts all winter and daylight lasts all summer. There are no cities or towns in Antarctica. The only people who live there are scientists who study Antarctica's weather, ice, rocks, and living things like plants, animals, and bacteria. Some scientists use Antarctica's thick ice to help them look for neutrinos, which are teeny tiny, really hard to find things from space that help us figure out how the universe works. Antarctica is so cold, when it snows there, the snow doesn't melt. It piles up until the snow gets so heavy it squeezes into a kind of ice called a glacier. Most of Antarctica is covered in this kind of ice, which is called the Antarctic Ice Sheet. It's the biggest piece of ice on Earth and has more water frozen in it than in all the lakes and rivers in the world put together. But not everything in Antarctica is frozen. This is Mount Erebus, an active volcano. It has a lake of lava in its crater. So it's a volcano covered in snow on the outside with a permanent lake of melted rock inside. Since animals need water and all the water on Antarctica is frozen, most animals in Antarctica live in or very near the ocean. The ocean around Antarctica is called the Southern Ocean. The water is very cold and deep. Even though it's so cold, plenty of animals have learned to survive in it, like humpback whales, sperm whales, orcas, Antarctic toothfish, jellyfish, and squid, including one that lives in the deepest water, the colossal squid, which may be the world's biggest invertebrate which are animals without skeletons. Lots of penguins live in Antarctica, but even though they sleep and nest on land, they swim in the ocean to find all their food, so they're considered ocean animals too. The biggest land animal currently living in Antarctica is the Antarctic midge, a wingless insect about as long as the eraser on a pencil. There used to be bigger animals on Antarctica, Millions and millions of years ago, the world was warmer and Antarctica was further north. Fossils in Antarctica show us that it used to have forests, frogs, lizards, and bigger animals like the Cryolophosaurus. That's right. Our frozen continent used to have dinosaurs.